Okay, this is a demonstration of measuring the oxygen headspace in a small food pack which has been modified atmosphere packaged uh, with nitrogen flushing. Now, this is a very liquid food sample. So first we will try and move all of the liquid product uh, down farther to remove it from the interior of the surface where we're going to puncture a needle through the package. And we do this as best we can, although we're not able to remove all of the food product. Then the next step before we analyze it is to put a small foam sticky on the package through which we will puncture our probe needle. And this will go, give us a good seal around the puncture point uh, to prevent air from leaking in. Now, this is a special needle arrangement we've put together which has a short tie-gone section so that you can see if any contamination is coming down through the needle into the tie-gone where it will stay instead of contaminating the sample probe. So we squeeze the package just a little bit. Now, we're going to do this without using the pump. If you squeeze the package a little bit, you'll create a little bit of pressure inside the package. And when you puncture it, the headspace gas will automatically be forced out through the probe into the analyzer. And you can see the readings start to go down. It's down to 5, 4, 3, 2. Now, in measurement of several um, other of these packages, the, the typical reading we get is between 1 and 2 percent. Now you can see some of the food product uh, came out of the needle and it remains in the Tigon piece. So the reading has stabilized at 1.6% O2. And for the next sample, we can remove this section, the needle, if you will. And this can easily be, easily be cleaned. And we can insert another one to measure the next sample. This is the end of our demonstration.